I'd like to take this opportunity to thank Van Marina Paul Godine for coming in to talk to Arthritis New Zealand today about his experiences with gout arthritis. So Paul, could you please tell us when was the first time that you found out about gout? Um, about five or six years ago. Yeah. yeah. And what happened for you? Oh, very painful. Yeah. Yeah, feels like my your toe is broken. <laughs> yeah. Then I got up one morning and I thought I kicked the wall. <laughs> yeah. Very sore. Yeah. So, um, what medicine did they give you when you first went to the doctor five years ago? Oh, he gave me a, what you call a prednisone and Motarin. And that yeah. helped get rid of that pain? Yeah. Yeah, it's all right, helping me, you know, for a short of, short of time. Yeah. Yeah. And how often would you have gotten a gout attack like that? It's about, sometimes it's about twice a year. Okay, yeah. so not too much. Not too much, but depends what yeah. kind of <laughs> food you eat and, and yeah. some of the drinks. Yeah. How did it make you feel when you had a gout attack? I felt annoying, yeah. yeah, very annoying, because I couldn't do what I, I couldn't do things I supposed to do with my family, or you know, sometimes can't go to work, mm. you know, yeah, not a good feeling. Mm. Mm. And did it affect when you couldn't? So you said prior that you had a daughter that was quite good with netball. Did it affect you being able to go to her, watch her games and things? Oh yeah, big time. Because, you know, sometimes I, I don't feel like getting out there, especially in winter time. Mm. You know, when it's really cold, it's, that's a, that's a time that the, the girls always attack. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, attack me. Yeah. yeah, okay. And so, when was the last time mm. you had a gout attack? The last time before Christmas. Okay. Yeah, before Christmas. And and what happened? Oh, I um, I was on Christmas holiday at home, and I was supposed to go and uh, help out my friend, you know, to play a few songs at his uh, birthday party or something like that. <clears throat> and then I, I, about three three days before the the kick, <laughs> and I fell, and uh, my toe got attacked, got attacked, <laughs> and I really, 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 I really annoyed because I thought uh, I'm not going to be able to go and uh, help him out, mm. and that's why I, I went straight to the A and E. And, and so the doctor did. And what did the doctor at A and E do? Oh, he laughed at me. He said, "I put you straight on Alperno." <laughs> <laughs> and I said, "Yes, it's time to go on." And, and so, <clears throat> um, did he explain to you how you have to take that Alperno? Yeah, yeah, it was uh, one pill a day. And he said to me, he was straight to me, and he said, "If you." Um, Take this pill and drink this pill. Yeah, this pill will help you get rid of the gout. You know, in in the long term, yeah. that'll be really good for me. Yeah, and I said, oh, okay, doctor, I will take it this time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not throwing it away anymore. And so, were you able to play at your friend's? Yes, gig? It was really good. I. Took the pills in a couple of days before the gig. I was fit to go again, <laughs> and I'm still fit till now. Right. Yeah. So it's been well over six months now, yeah. and no, no more gout no attacks. No more attack. Really good body.
join its viewers group. Yeah. Excellent. Makes me really happy. Mm. Excellent. And, okay. I suppose the last question for yeah. you is have you got any advice for people having gout attacks? Yes. My advice if you have if you have a gout attack, please go to your doctor and see if aeroperinol is right for you. Because maybe one pill a day and I I tell you what will better your life and things you do with your family. And if you have any question, don't be hesitate to don't contact Ofridas New Zealand. They're here to help you. God bless. Have time.